the body tag life cycle the life cycle of a tag handler that implements the body tag interface in jakarta server pages uh, uh here you can see the eval body tag uh, life cycle the life cycle of the of a tag handler that implements the body tag interface here uh, so this this figure summarizes the tag life cycle uh, setting the context as with uh, as with all the other classic tags first the contextual information the page context and parent tag is passed to the tag handler instance start tag uh, after context has been set the do start tag method is called and with the body tag interface there are are uh, three different return values as before as before the do start tag method can return skip body um, uh, meaning that the body content is ignored and processing proceed to the do end tag uh, method or it can return a well body include uh, uh, signaling that the body content should be evaluated and included in the page the difference is that the do start tag uh, method can now return the eval body buffered uh, contact defined in the body tag interface returning this value indicates to the jsp container that you want to use the features provided by the ta body tag interface especially that the tag handler will manipulate the body content um setting the body content uh assuming that you return eval body buffered uh from the do start tag method uh, to indicate that you want to manipulate the body content uh, the set body content method is called on the tag handler so that the tag can hold on to the body content reference and use it later as you may remember from the previous uh, before the simple uh, tag have a similar method called set jsp body method that passes jsp fragment instance representing the actual body of the tag with the body tag interface this process is slightly different instead of uh, uh, instead of passing be instead of being passed the jsp fragment represent in the body content that can subsequently invoke the tag handler is passed an object of type body content throughout our look at the classic tag generating content was simply a matter of finding the jsp writer instance associated with the page and outputting the content the body content class is a subclass of jsp writer and can be thought of as a temporary scratch pad area of to which uh, content can be written behind the scenes the when the jsp container calls the set body content method the regular output stream the jsp writer is swapped out for the body content object the same one that get passed to the tag this means that the any content output from this point onward until then the tag is reached actually return to the temporary scratch pad not to the page the jsp container then called the do init body uh, method which can then be used to set up any state before the body content is eventually evaluated the effect of replacing uh, the original jsp writer is that the when evaluated when uh, any content between the start and end tags has also be written to the body content object um providing you with the way to access generated content with manipulator it later uh, after the body uh, uh after the body as with the iteration tag interface uh the do after body uh, method is called after the body content has been evaluated there are no change just here the method should return eval body again or Uh, skip body 
do to signal whether the more evaluation of the body content is are required and tag uh, the finally regardless of whether or not the body was evaluated and re-evaluated multiple times the do and tag method is called in the same way as the other tags how you have been seen in this chapter again possible return value side value page uh, and skip page skip body sorry uh well page and skip page at this point in the life cycle all of the body content has been evaluated and output into the body content object uh, 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 the temporary sketch pad uh, with the, this in mind you can now take this content and manipulate tra transform it when you are done you can then write the final result to the original is uh, JSP writer interface here the method uh, int do we start tag uh, draws jspx exception the process start tag for the instance this method invoked by the jsp page implementation object uh, Um, static final int eval body buffered the request the creation of new buffer uh, the body content on which to evaluate the body of this tag return from the do start tag when the when it implements body tag this is an illegal return value for do start tag when the cl class does not implement body tag Uh, eval body include uh, static final int eval body include evaluate body into existing out string valid return value for uh, do start tag this one and uh, static final int skip body skip body evaluation valid return value for do start tag and do after body uh, Um, so void set body content body content set the body content property this method is invoked by the JSP paid implementation object at once to action invocation this method will be invoked before in do init body this method will not be invoked for empty tags so or for or for non empty tags whose do start tag method return skip body or eval body include Uh, void do init body prepare for evaluation uh, of the body this method is invoked by JSP page implementing objects after set body content and uh, uh, before the first time the bodies should be evaluated uh, this method will not be invoked for empty tags or for non empty tags whose do start tax method returns skip body or uh, 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 or uh, eval body include uh, int do after body the process body's uh, evaluation this method invoked by the JSP page implementation object after every evaluation of the body into the body evaluation object this method is not invoked if there is no body evaluation uh, static final int eval body again 
request the re-evaluation of some body returned from do after body uh, for compatibility with JSP 1.1 the value is carefully selected to be the same as the new deprecated now deprecated body tag dot eval body tag Uh, static final int skip body skip body evaluation valid return value for do start tag and do after body eval uh, static final int eval page continuing well evaluating the page valid return value for do and tag and here the skip page uh, skip page Static file and skip page, skip the rest of the page, valid return value for do and uh, do and tag. Static final int skip body, skip body evaluation, valid return value for do start tag and do after body. Int do and tag method, process int tag for this instance this method is invoked by the JSP page implementation object on all tag handlers uh, here I start it's connected to initialize context and attributes and it is connected to do start tag method and do start tag method is connected to set body content via eval body buffered and set, uh, set body content is connected to int do int body method then it is connected to eval body here the do start tag is connected to eval body via eval body include uh, evaluate uh, evaluate body is connected to do after body method and do after body method is connected to evaluate body via eval body again and do after body is connected to uh, do end tag via skip body and uh, do start tag is connected to do and tag via skip body do and tag is connected to evaluate rest of the page via eval page and it is connected to the end and do and tag is connected to the end via skip page now uh, this is the uh, end of my presentation thank you very much for watching it